Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Um, it is Friday, about 8 o'clock, and I'm on the way to Glen Allen, meeting up with Riley and Isabel at a hotel. We're gonna spend the night there tonight, get everything organized, and then tomorrow, um, Riley's gonna run the uh, Copper Basin 300. It's a sled dog race in Glen Allen. I uh, told them I'm gonna help them out a little bit here and there handling dogs and uh, running supplies around with Isabel while Riley's gonna run the race. So we got about 20 more miles here into Glen Allen and then we're gonna spend the night there, get some rest and uh, we'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning Glen Allen. 12 below, dogs are coming out for a little stretching and going to the bathroom and getting fed. And we are number six today. We're parked at our parking spot and now we're gonna get the dogs out. Good boy, Elway. Tolsona to the Tolsona Lodge, right? Checkpoint one. And it's approximately 50 miles for them. So it's that straight down the roads, so they have to do a different track. And they should get in about five hours after when they left. So we got a little bit of time. So we're heading to Tolsona, grab something to eat, and then we're just waiting for the team to come in. Every checkpoint has a designated supply bag. We're grabbing the bag for Tolsona checkpoint. We got a really nice, cute trapper's cabin. It looks like it's been here for a long time. Good job, Riley.
We're gonna grab a nice hot tea. In a little bit, we just need to figure out where Riley and the teams are coming in so we have all the food ready and supplies for the dogs. On our way to the next checkpoint, the northern lights were just phenomenal and we pulled over and just sat there for a few minutes and enjoyed the beauty of it. And good morning again. We are at the Sourdough Campground, uh, about 45 minutes north of Glen Allen. And the team is resting right now. They're taking the mandatory six hour break. So we're gonna get some good food in us here in a little bit and then uh, get the team ready for the next step.
Checkpoint number four, Myers Lake Roadhouse. Riley is on his way here. And we're gonna go check with the lead guys here where we need to set up. Myers Lake checkpoint was the end of the trail for Riley's team in the Cover Basin 300 race 2023. Scratching from a race is never an easy decision or one you want to make, but sometimes it's the best move for the races later in the season. Riley has all the great details about the race on his Facebook page, Dark Horse Racing Kennel. It's a really interesting post if you want to check it out. Goes the dog team back to Fairbanks, and I'm gonna be heading to Rosilla. The race was over, but God blessed me with an amazing drive home and once again showed me the beauty of Alaska. Thank you for watching our video, hope you enjoyed it and we will see you in the next one.